Good morning guys. Wow, this is literally one of the first vlogs I've filmed in the new apartment. This is so strange because I'm used to seeing myself in this, but like obviously with a different background. We're in the new apartment. There is lots of videos about this apartment. I will leave them linked down below for you. So I'm actually doing something really cool today and I'm seeing my friend Elle for a little bit kind of mid late afternoon and we're basically going to a little pub in Twickenham called Barmy Arms and what they've got is this really cool Land Rover for icebreaker beer and basically they are touring different pubs on different weekends and stuff and you can get beer from the Land Rover so it's like a traveling bar essentially which I think is really cool and really great for social distancing so it used to be takeaway only but obviously now the restrictions have lifted a little bit it's now so you can actually sit there and enjoy it so we thought it would be really cute if we just went down had a beer sat and had a chat because I haven't seen her in I mean I saw her last week but I get withdrawals from my friends quite quickly so um yeah we're gonna sit have a beer have a chat and I think it's only like half an hour from my house which is really close for London like everything's round about in half an hour if you're in London so very very close I've not been to Twickenham before so I'm actually quite excited to see the area and just spend some time outside because with lockdown we've all been inside so much and my old apartment obviously didn't have any outside space so I'm just really looking forward to being outside and just enjoying like some fresh air, some company, and some beer. I am a beer girl, which I don't think many people expect, but I love a good beer. I actually used to drink beer quite a lot at festivals and stuff, but I love it. So we're gonna go have a little catch up in a beer, potentially like some chips or something, who knows, but I'll obviously take you guys along with me. So I'm just gonna go ahead and put on my face and get dressed. Need to decide what I'm gonna wear, but I'm gonna get dressed in a minute as well. What can I wear? What do we think I should wear if I'm going for like a cute little like pub date with a friend? I'm thinking maybe like, I've worn jeans for a few days, so I'm thinking maybe like a dress or a play suit or something could be quite cute. We'll see, leave it with me. I'm ready, facially, and my hair, I have procrastinated for a little bit because I just had loads of other like random things to do around the house and stuff, like picking up parcels from downstairs and whatever. So I'm now trying to get dressed and I don't really know what to wear. I've got this on for now, but I don't know if this is gonna be what I end up in. And I just don't know what to put on. Like, I don't know what I feel like wearing. I don't know what the weather's really like to know what to wear. It's just hard, it's a hard decision. Part of me is thinking maybe like some shorts with a jumper. Um, so I've got these shorts, which match the ones I've currently got on, which I'll show you in a minute. And I'm thinking I could maybe do this jumper. I'm gonna give that a try. We're gonna see what I think, because I just really don't know what to put on and I, I don't know what it is about lockdown, but it's made me find getting dressed so hard because I just don't know what to put on my body half the time. Like, I go to get dressed and I'm like, I can't remember what clothes are like. <laughs> right, I've just chucked on an outfit and I'm not sure how I feel. I don't know if it's maybe gonna be too cold for this. It is quite dark and like a bit gloomy outside, but I put on these little shorts. I've also got some boots that I'm gonna put on and then I've got on this sleeveless little turtleneck. So I thought that was kind of like an ode to autumn, but also still keeping it kind of summery. And then just throwing a little jumper over the top, which I thought I could potentially add a blazer to, cause I thought it might be quite cute to like put a blazer on with this look. But I'm thinking I might end up just going with jeans. And then these are the boots. They're just like little nasty girl numbers. But I don't know. I'm gonna try on a different outfit and see what I think. Or do we go with this outfit? Because it is getting kind of autumnal outside, so I feel like I can get away with a jumper. So I've just slung on this, is that even a word, slung? I've thrown on, I've thrown on this little dog tooth blazer. So I've got this jumper on underneath with these shorts and then the boots. And I'm thinking this is more of like an autumnal look that I'm kind of loving. But I don't know whether to go with this blazer or this blazer. I'm feeling like this is more me and this is quite a cute look. What do we think? I mean, by the time you watch this, I'll have decided, but what do we think? What's your favorite outfit that I've put on? <laughs> so I'm just waiting for Elle and thought I would sit down and quickly explain what we're actually going to be doing. So basically there is a truck, which is from the brand called Icebreaker. So it's Icebreaker Pale Ale that has been made by apprentices in the Green King microbrewery. And it's basically now like part of their portfolio. So you can buy it in Waitrose and a couple of other places. And basically they have got a van, which is like Icebreaker branded, that's going to a couple of different pubs. And it's currently at the Barmy Arms in Twickenham. So that's where we're gonna be going today. And you can get a takeaway pint or you can have it in their beer garden. But I don't know what we're gonna do yet. I think we might get a takeaway one. Um, and apparently you can sit on the riverside and it's really, really lovely. So hopefully that's what we're gonna do. If not, we'll just sit in the pub garden, just play it by ear and see what we want to do when we get there. But I'm really excited and I'm intrigued to kind of go out for a socially distanced something because I feel like it's been a really long time since I've gone out and enjoyed like a drink or anything like that out and about. And it's something I used to do all the time. So 
I'm very excited. They have really good social distancing measures in place, so I'm sure it'll be absolutely fine. And I'm gonna take my mask and stuff anyway, just in case. later and I'm now with Elle, she's here, looking beautiful. <laughs> we have got to Twickenham and we've just picked up our beer from a little, it's like behind this cart, you can't really see it so I'll show you in a minute, but we picked up our beer from the van, really super easy, the girl that's working is really lovely, so contactless, so quick and easy and we've got our beers now so we're just having a little chill on the side of the Thames and just enjoying the weather. It's such a nice day today, it's absolutely beautiful so we're gonna have a little drink, a little catch up. Oh, it's chill. so nice because there's so much space here as well. You feel like you can just like hang out and chill and do your own little thing. Yeah, it's really nice. And everyone's very distant, which yeah. is nice. There's not even many people, but it's really nice We're just watching each other. We do. I think everyone's avoided us. Like we've taken space. <laughs> we have. <haven't> we? <laughs> but it's really nice and we're gonna have to catch up. I've actually never been to Twickenham before, so it's really nice it's to so just nice. chill. It's nice around here. So nice. <laughs> Where, is being... Where is it? Where is it? It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Oh, it's fine. Oh, okay, it's definitely on me. Okay. It's fine, it's okay. not fine. Okay. It's right, not fine. cheers, hon. Cheers. <laughs> I'm gonna break down. Cheers. Oh my God, that's so good. So this is the icebreaker drink I was talking about. So this is the pale ale beer. We're gonna get on and enjoy and then that's we'll catch up with you in a minute. Little summer summer. <laughs> little summer something. <laughs> hours later as you can see my flat is now dark <laughs> I am actually wrapped up in my dressing gown and I've had a shower and stuff because it was really nice and warm today so I just wanted to get in have a cold shower snuggle up in a little dressing gown with a cup of tea and do my journaling which is something I've really started getting into the last couple of weeks and it's something I really enjoy so I take time to reflect on the day and plan tomorrow's adventures so if I've got like shoots to do for example or if there's any campaigns I need to do or any admin like just making note of anything that needs necessary to be done that like definitely needs to be done um, and it's just a really nice way to end the day and today was just honestly so lovely we actually sat down by the river for a few hours and just talked about literally everything and we talked about life we talked about the future we talked about houses we talked about literally everything and it was really nice to just sit down with a friend and feel like everything was kind of back to normal again or whatever the kind of new normal is going to be but Obviously, as you saw, we were really socially distanced. There wasn't many people about and it was just so nice to relax and just feel kind of free and out in the open and enjoy the outside space, which obviously in my old flat, I didn't really have any outside space. So anytime I can get outside, I do. And especially like a kind of pub atmosphere because I really love just being like in a pub garden, like enjoying a drink, socializing. And it was just really, really nice. So. If you haven't heard of Icebreaker, I definitely recommend you give them a try because the drink was delicious. It's basically like a pale ale beer. It's so delicious. I'm not like the biggest beer person ever. I like a selected few beers and I haven't really like ventured into them much. I quite like fruity drinks, but that was definitely one of my favorite of ones that I've tried because I've tried quite a few in my time and there is a few that stand out, but that's definitely up top of the list now. Um, if you wanted to try it out yourself, there is going to be the Icebreaker Jeep going around a few different places this summer and also also, it's available in Waitrose and on the Green King website so definitely check it out and make sure that you try it at some point because I can highly recommend very refreshing and very delicious we both really enjoyed it um, and yeah I'm maybe gonna sign off here because I think I'm gonna have a really chilled night depending on how I feel in like 20 minutes I might actually do a bit of like nighttime yoga because I think it will just kind of help me to wind down and I know yoga with Adrian does like really cool 30 day ones on YouTube so I think I might maybe do that but I just feel very relaxed right now and I feel very good for having seen a friend all day and just it, it honestly 
this has been the craziest few months of lockdown and life in general and it just feels really nice to be back to normal so yeah um potentially there might be a couple more vlog clips if there's not then i'll say goodbye here and love you and leave you but i hope you enjoyed this video guys don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you liked it if you want me to bring back more vlogs let me know i'm thinking i might bring back the weeklies from now on because they are honestly some of my favorite things to do and i quite like seeing my weeks back um my tv's just turned off because it's been sat on pause for so long um it's yeah they're one of my favorite things to do so let me know if you want to see more of that and i will more than happily oblige if you haven't already checked out my moving vlogs you probably have seen my background change by now if you haven't then i don't know you must have just been staring at me for too long <laughs> but um yeah hopefully you are enjoying the moving series and stuff and yeah um i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys